So now I'm going to demonstrate for you a means we have for measuring both liquids and powders. We're going to use powders in this example using our MetaView VS3200 instrument. It's in a stand, and this stand has in it a drawer, and this drawer slides in and out. And you can see I've got some, some powders here. This happens to be paprika that I've already loaded into this little spoon that comes with the stand. And that spoon fits right into this little cutout in place. I can now slide that drawer in, and it will position that powder exactly where I need it to take a measurement. So let's come over to the software, because in the software I can see because I have an image-based spectrophotometer, an image of what's going to be measured. In fact, you can see that it's an image by the fact that if I move it, you can actually see me sliding it in and out. So I'm gonna slide that to a spot where I'm gonna take the measurement, I'm gonna give it a name, I'm gonna hit next, and the instrument's going to start taking its measurement. Now, an image-based instrument is slightly slower in measuring because of the kind of instrument that it is, but when it's done, I'm going to get color difference very, very similar to the previous measurement. They're both 0.17 delta E, 2000 away from the color standard. Now I can quality control a powder. A liquid could, could work the same way. Um, we could load it into the spoon the same way and use the fact that this is a non-contact instrument to measure something we can't quite measure very well in a regular contact kind of instrument. So I can measure like the paprika like I did. Maybe I'm gonna measure something like cinnamon like the other spoon that's here and judge it with something very specific like the cinnamon index. There are various spices that have specific indices that are used to measure their quality and based on what, where they fall in an indice can even affect the price that can be charged for those spices. So it's a very important thing. This instrument with this stand and the spoon and the drawer allows us to measure those powders and those liquids.